I'm here with Dr. Romano to do a problem on solubility and KSP. Hi, come around. I'd like to go over a really good problem with you that I think you'll enjoy. This is a fast one, but it's going to drive home a very important concept. I give you the KSP of two salts, silver chloride, 1.8 to the minus 10, and silver iodide at 8.3 to the minus 17. Silver nitrate is added dropwise to one liter of an O1 O molar chloride and an O1 O molar iodide solution. Which will precipitate first? So we want to basically know would we get silver chloride, which would be a white solid, or would we get the tan solid, which would be the silver iodide? First thing we're going to do is to understand for both of them, a small amount of silver is needed to cause precipitation. So the idea is we need to find how much silver will get you totally saturated. And once we do that, that's the amount that we need to exceed before we get precipitation. So let's take the first salt. We take silver chloride, breaks up into silver and chloride, up goes the KSP. Remember, anything they give you the KSP for is a solid, so we don't use that in the expression. So the KSP is the silver times the chloride. We know the KSP of silver chloride is 1.8 to the minus 10th. We don't know the silver. We know the chloride ion is O1O. This gives me 1.8 to the minus 8 molar of silver. If this is exceeded, you get precipitation. So that's the amount that I need to add, and then boom, we exceed that amount. This is the amount needed to cause equilibrium, to give you a totally saturated solution. Anything beyond that will cause the precipitate to form. Silver iodide is done in the same way. We know the KSP is 8.3 to the minus 17th, we know the iodide, and we solve for the silver. I'm hoping you can see the silver is much, much smaller. So that means you only need a tiny, tiny amount of silver in order to cause precipitation. So when you get to 8.3 to the minus 15th, when you exceed that small amount, you get your first precipitate. So the smaller amount of silver would give you the first precipitate. And I hope you can see that would be silver iodide, which precipitates first. Very important question for the DAT. Make sure you can do KSP. I have a whole bunch more of these in the DAT Destroyer, but this should give you some good ideas. All right, good day to you. Bye-bye.